from the first local station with news in high definition. This is Nine News Now. Also tonight, we check in with one of the youngest patients to be treated at a local hospital with an extremely targeted form of radiation. Her name is Kaylee Vance, and she has a smile that melts your heart. I want to get better. That's all six-year-old Kaylee Vance really wants, is to get better. The little girl from Ashburn, Virginia, and her parents have been making regular trips to Georgetown University Hospital for months now, so Kaylee could undergo radiation and chemotherapy. Kaylee has what's called rhabdomyosarcoma, a cancerous tumor that started in her jaw and was pushing up into her brain. Kaylee was only five when doctors discovered the malignant growth. When your five-year-old daughter is diagnosed with uh, an aggressive cancer. It's obviously, it just knocks the winds out of you. Kaylee's one of the first children treated at Georgetown with the CyberKnife robotic device. It delivers small, ultra targeted beams of radiation that allow doctors to attack otherwise inoperable tumors and protect sensitive structures nearby. So now we can deliver much higher doses to areas we want and avoid. And the toxicity that's usually associated with radiation. To make sure patients are perfectly still during the cyber knife treatments, they wear a custom made mask. Kaylee, always the artist, turned hers into a peacock. While she is still undergoing chemo through the end of this month, the results have been promising so far. Her mom says the most recent scan of Kaylee's head showed most of the cancer cells are dead. Hopefully, you'll never come back. And <laughs> but if it does, we'll deal with it because we're a strong family. Kaylee's oncology team plans to do some final tests in August, then she's off to first grade in the fall and very excited about it. Georgetown University Hospital added a second cyber knife to its arsenal last year to meet the growing demand for this high-tech, targeted treatment. For more Living Well stories, you can always log on to WUSA9.com, click on News, and scroll down to Living Well. Derek.